What do you swear you saw, but don't have any proof of? Was living in Japan in a city called Miyazaki. Was watching TV around the Christmas season. Station was MRT's was about 10 p.m. at night. There was a station ID break and it ended with a full screen large type message in English. Merry Christmas fuck you. This was 1993. A comet or something explode into a giant green fireball when I was a kid. It Sitting at the campsite and a beaver walks out of the lake. Like on its hind legs. And proceeds to walk like this through the campsite and into the woods like it's on its way to. Pooh's house or whatever. Just strolling. I know goddamn well I saw a zebra grazing in a pasture while visiting colleges in northern central Ohio. This was a good 15 years ago. I saw an ivory-billed woodpecker in college. I'm not a bird enthusiast or anything but I saw this giant woodpecker pecking weird and I watched it until it flew off. A day or two later I saw on the news that one had been spotted near my area and that was a big deal. Because they were declared extinct in 1944. A lion at my parents' house when I was a kid. My older brother saw it too. Coincidentally. A lion went missing from a zoo in Ohio around that time and was never found. My brother and I swore we saw it but obviously had no proof. That winter, my parents found giant paw prints outside that definitely were not a dog, cat, coyote, etc. Years later when I was a freshman in high school, my friend's mom was driving me home and swore she saw a lion run across the road my parents live on. She never even knew the story about me swearing there was a lion out there. She was so convinced that she immediately called the police. That was all the proof I needed to know I was never crazy and know what I saw as a kid. I saw a fox chasing a turkey on a hot summer day. They both tired out and stopped running at the same time and laid down to rest then they got up to continue the chase after about a minute. Some absolute cartoon nonsense that I swear happened. But I wouldn't believe me either. Kathy Bates. I was working the closing shift at a Publix in Atlanta as a bagger and I swear I saw her start to leave. I went up and went, excuse me, did you know you look like? The woman interrupted and went, Kathy Bates. Yes, I know, then she smiled and walked out of the store. Thundersnow. In college we had team workouts at 5.30 am during the winter. When we emerged from our dorms we were greeted by an absolutely insane lightning display combined with driving snow. The walk across campus was absolutely insane. Like something from the day after tomorrow. When we finished the workout around 7. It had warmed up and had changed to rain and everything had melted. There were 25 guys on the roster and we all know what we saw. But none of our friends believed us. I swear I saw a cougar walking down the side of the road on my way home from my girlfriend's outside town at like 3 a.m. once. An ocelot behind a North Carolina dumpster and a zebra running in a ditch on I-40. Also in North Carolina. A monkey wearing a football helmet driving a Volvo wagon through my uncle's neighborhood at night. In 1995. I was six but I know what I saw. Ball lightning. Okay, I get how cliche and fake this sounds but just bear with me. My parents bought a very large but old and decrepit New England home. I was running around it relatively alone back when I was barely elementary school age. I was running up the stairs. At the top it takes a 90 degrees turn onto the floor. I remember getting to the fourth-ish step from the top, grabbing the top railing and swinging around to the floor only to see, something. It looked like, a wide human leg made out of wood but where the knee should be was a deep socketed face. The entire thing looked like it was melting. 
kind of like E.T. covered in mud. I just remember freezing and looking up to lock eyes with it. Then it started moaning in a way. That sounded like warp wood moaning in pleasure from the pain. Obviously I booked it out of there and hid in the family car. Now, I'm not saying I saw something supernatural. I've always had a very overactive imagination. I routinely saw stuff as a kid like faces in collection of leaves on branches. That being said, I remember seeing something so clear that was just there one second. Then gone the next. I swear I could hear it moaning and screaming. Even as I write this. Had some unexplainable moment when I was a child where I was playing a soccer game and was behind. Everyone. Suddenly my vision spun and I found myself in front of the goal with the soccer ball at my feet. I didn't feel sick or anything. Took the shot and made it. A corpse in a ditch on the side of the road. I was a kid. Told my parents as we drove by and they got mad at me for having such a morbid imagination. Driving on a semi-rural road south of Salem, Oregon about 15 years ago. I swear I saw some cryptid-looking bipedal wolf thing. My GF at the time was with me and we both saw it. Didn't really talk about it. Just kinda accepted we saw something we couldn't explain. Me and a buddy were laying on some playground equipment after a night of drinking when both of us. At the same time go, what's that? There was a light up in the sky about twice as bright as the stars around it. Staying still in the sky. That we hadn't noticed before. Suddenly it picks up speed goes from directly overhead to over the horizon in about 5 seconds. I swear in Pokemon Red one time I used Splash it actually did a single point of damage. A Fruit of the Loom logo with a cornucopia, back in 1994. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epicaracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.